Happy Wednesday, everyone. This is a pick a card reading for today, September 11th. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I do pull the cards together there for all of us. And if you are born today, September 11th, babies, I'll do a reading for you next. If you picked card number one, you have the Queen of Cups. Okay, you could be dealing with a significant female in your life. This is a Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces is coming into play for some of you, okay? Um, I do feel that there could be some change, okay? This is unexpected change today, and you can manifest very quickly, all right, um, things into your life. Um, delving into spirituality, you have spiritual messages and warnings today too, okay? So I do pick up that energy. Uh, for some of you, this is dealing with health issues, and if you if something has been um, lingering on, it's time to visit the doctor. For others of you, this is definitely following your intuition as well. All right, if you pick card number two, you have a major arcana of the sun. So this is an um, important day for you because it's a major arcana. They are significant. Um, beautiful energy. You are definitely in the spotlight. People um, are warm up to you very well. Um, this is good with children. They, they. Um, if you are a parent, um, they definitely love. Uh, you know, they, they benefit from your uh, parenting. Um, so seeing that, they kind of like admire you. Uh, children admire you. Other people admire you too. You're definitely in the spotlight. There's abundance today all as well. And definitely there is um, a lot of peace and um, creativity around you. There's some kind of a celebration. There's a focus on the home and family as well. Um, definitely beautiful energy there, I have to say. I cannot say anything negative here. Definitely seeing something great no matter what. All right, if you pick card number three, you have the Page of Pentacles. Okay, a sudden breakthrough. If you do, just say you applied for a job, for example, I'm picking that up for someone, and they, you didn't get, um, you didn't get one job, another one's going to come in quickly, okay? There will be some opportunity here. For some of you, there's a breakthrough stagnancy, but opportunities are coming. Expect some change, okay? And I think it's positive as well, all right? All right, a crisis will turn into a blessings, blessing in disguise, though, is what I'm feeling as well for some of you, okay? All right, so when we're looking at all, all of this today, I do see that there is a focus on business. There's a focus on generosity, security, wealth. Um, there is also um, mastering things in our life today, so that's good. Um, I do feel slow and steady wins the race, okay? So opportunities are abound. I do see talk and counsel may be needed, but people are willing to help us today. So ask for help if you need it. And I see happiness, love, and support around us. So that is a beautiful energy for today. All right. So that is the reading for today, um, September 11th, Wednesday. Have a fabulous Wednesday. Happy birthday if you're born today, September 11th. This is your solar, your theme, and that is your wish card. Your solar, your theme is the Ten of Swords. Okay. So this is a year of many endings. Um, things may be rehashed. Um, and because, you know, it's like there were some issues that maybe have not been, um, you know, they've just never really, um, you never found closure, but you will this year with some, okay. Um, these could be triggers from the past as well. So these are like old pains and hurts and betrayals. You may also feel that you've been defeated or you're looking at coulda, shoulda, woulda, but I do see this year, you're definitely in the spotlight. You're definitely starting over again somehow, and there's a raise in your, um, I want to say, status somehow, and there is people are changing. It's like your reputation somehow is much better, um, so I do feel that energy as well. For others, be careful of people trying to throw you underneath the bus. Um, there could be some painful um Induendos with females, so I do feel that energy as well. Pay attention to your dreams, follow your intuition. There's going to be some life changes. They could be very emotional as well. Your subconscious is trying to talk to you. And I do feel the moon, like moon phases or the eclipses are going to be very significant for you. Uh, you could be dealing with some uh, fear and anxiety. Follow your intuition, though, as well. Hard work, perseverance is going to pay off. I do see some of you working um, and um, money coming in and additional, too. Some of you, this is visiting, um, getting your health in order. Some of you are going to start some thera uh, therapy or Reiki or taking care of your health. 
Um, talking counsel is important. You do have, do have someone very supportive around you too. Um, this is also um, getting more emotionally balanced this year too. I do feel also love is coming into your life. Um, so, and this is a soulmate, okay? Soulmate or twin flame. Uh, travel plans for the future and choices and decisions you make. And this is also tra um, uh, plans, you know, and moving along with some things as well. So love could be moving along as well. Um, I do feel um, there's a focus on your health too, your health and well-being. Um, focus this year, there could be, you could be accident prone at times too, or someone around you as well. Um, there is a recovery though. I do see that energy as well. You could be dealing with a Pisces and definitely Pisces is coming through and also Aquarius this year. Okay. And your wish for your solar year is the six of wands. I do feel this wish is going to come to fruition. All right. Um, important numbers for your solar year. 18, 8, 2, 4. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. And bye for now.